Hello everyone and welcome back to another Foam Crop 3 video. Today I'm going to talk about the Wand of Equal Trade. This purple one. It's used to change materials to other ones. Firstly you need to right click on a material, a sandstone. Shift right click I mean. And you will see a little glowing thing with the sandstone block in it, right over. Uh, your inventory slot bar and then when you right click on a material like this jungle wood you will change it into sandstone and if I shift right click with it on this jungle wood here I can change it back just like that So the ranges on the ones are three bro blocks, and I'm not cou counting the middle. So it's seven across, three from where you clicked. And if you shift, oh, if you right click, you will only change one block at a time. Four blocks is the range of an enchanted wand of equal trade. So this is Potentia one. Potency increases the power of the wand. So on this one it will increase the range. The Potentia two has five or 11 and the last one has 6 or 13 and you should note this takes durability on the tools as you see now and it won't charge up f because these kinds of ones, ones don't charge up from the atmosphere except if they have the charging enchantment this one charging then they will slowly recharge So then, uh, if you're careful, the one will never break. They only change blocks that are connected to air. So if I dig down here, these won't be changed. But these blocks here are. So when I change the blocks here, it is the range of this or just with this so that's how the one works and now I'm going to show you one more thing you can have a treasure enchantment on it so I think this one has treasure so right click here so now there's four of these. I got 11 shards. I don't remember how many you usually get, but you get more this way. Lastly, I'm going to show you a... Uh, I think it's a bug. That works with bu saplings, cactus, and uh, torches and something else, but I recommend saplings. Uh, where's the one, 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 one? Firstly, we need to put down a sapling. Like this. And probably give us some more stacks of saplings. Uh, 
and we can enchant it so it will have a bigger area effect. Charging one, potential two, and treasure two. That's a good one. And now, let's show you. As you see, it places down the saplings, but the saplings can't be on uh, stone or s sandstone in this case. Then the saplings will drop down on the ground again. So it's a super fast mining tool. It will uh, take a lot of durability on your wand. But when you have played for a bit and have a lot of resources, this method could be used to clear out areas or mine quite fast. But I think it's a bug and I think Asenor will do so you can't do it fix the bug because you can't do this with sugarcane and some other materials but if you like this video I hope you like the video and thanks for watching